you know what kind of people I don't really like? Nice people. I know, it sounds like a weird thing to say. Hi, I'm Dr. Leanne Davey, and well, it's not that I don't like nice people, but I find nice is really hurtful on teams. Nice people, they, you know, they smile after your not very great presentation and you ask how it went, and they're like, mm hmm, yeah, mm hmm, good. That's a nice person who thinks that telling you the truth would, you know, crush you. And the nice person, when you start gossiping to them about something, they just, yeah, mm hmm, yeah, mm hmm. And that's, well, it's nice, but. I think nice on teams is an excuse for lazy, passive behavior, and I don't think it's good enough. So for me, I replace the word nice and the idea and the voice in my head saying, well, that wouldn't be nice. I replace that with this standard of being kind instead of being nice. Kind requires something a bit more active. So when your friend comes to you and they say, I got this feedback from the boss. Isn't that ridiculous? I'm totally not like that. Instead of trying to be nice, I mean, oh, you're great. The kind person actually says, well, did the boss have any examples? Maybe we could talk them through, or I could share with you some ideas about how you might've handled that situation differently. That's kind. It, it means you care about the person and you wanna help them be successful, but you just aren't being nice and polite and civil and courteous. and and really, you know, somebody who is not helping them to be better. In the situation where the colleague comes to you gossiping and the nice person is just sort of staying quiet and nodding along, the kind person is saying, sounds like things aren't going well in your relationship. What do you think's going on? You know, why don't you just share with me how you might wanna broach that issue with the person and, and I'll give you some thoughts. Kindness is a much higher bar and we need more kindness in our relationships. Not, you know, not feeling like we can't say anything to a colleague because that's throwing them under the bus, but instead having trust that's based on knowing that you're gonna say the things the person needs to hear. You're not gonna deceive them or sugarcoat something. You're actually gonna help them turn uncomfortable situations into learning opportunities. That is a kind colleague, and I would trade a kind colleague for a nice colleague any day of the week. All right, that's it for me. I'm Dr. Leanne Davey, here to help you get the team and the colleagues that you deserve.